What are you doing up here, Tony? I just finished installing some uh, roof brackets for our laners. What do we put them on the roof for? So we don't fall off because falls kill us. That's right. <laughs> I'm not an actor. What? I'm not an actor. <laughs> This ain't Hollywood. No. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, today we're putting up some uh, roof brackets because the back of this uh, property here is uh, two-story. As you can see, it's fairly uh, steep down the back side here. So, um, you know, working on the eaves troughs has uh, an element of risk, obviously, because of the fact that a lot of times eaves troughs are done from the roof or from ladders. And uh, by law, if if you're working at a height over 10 feet high, you're supposed to be tied off with a harness and uh, ropes and the lanyards. So that these here will prevent you from, uh, if you do happen to slide over the edge, it'll arrest your fall or prevent you from falling over the edge in the first place. You know, hire contractors that will uh, wear this uh, protective equipment. It will uh, potentially save someone's life. And the other key thing too is that uh, people assume that, you know, most companies do uh, wear this uh, protective gear, but it's actually pretty rare. So, um, part of maybe when you're trying to hire a uh, company, look at their marketing material. If they have pictures all over their, uh, I don't know, website or whatever of guys up on roofs that are unprotected, don't have harnesses, ro or not uh, properly protected, then you can have a pretty good idea that maybe when they arrive to your home, that they're not going to be uh, working in a safe manner. So, just one little tip there.